Hi people and welcome. I want to talk to you today about ChatGPT, which is quite a recent bot, but this bot is unbelievable. It can do a lot, a lot of things, okay? Um, one of the things, reasons why I wanted to actually bring this up. Now, sorry if I've been online for a while. Reason being is I had a major problem with a sinus infection and one side of my face literally was swollen and the other side was like normal. So I looked like something from the Fantastic Four. It was quite scary. So that's the reason why I haven't had to shave at the moment because my mouth's still a bit dodgy around here. So I've just got to be a bit careful. So what we're going to talk about is ChatGPT. Okay, now what is ChatGPT? How does it work? Well, it basically works creating essays. You can create um, your own um, software with it. You can create your own um machine code with it as well right and this is a crazy thing it's completely free this is only one of the tools that i've included inside affiliate toolbox okay so you know um that's something that i released about seven ten days ago and there are 60 other things that you can actually use secret websites that you can actually use so if you think this is good you wait and check out the rest that i've got loaded up right um and you can purchase that which will be a link below in the description i think it'll cost you around about 12 13 quid something like that okay so it's a very, very good affordable price i also give you access to my free rotator which shows you basically how to set up your rotator and make money online so let's get straight into it so i'm going to shrink the screen down straight down and we're going to jump straight into this okay so how do you use chat gpt now basically you just talk to it on command as if it's your friend right and you're not going to believe this right now what i try to do or what i have been doing is i've been doing a lot lots of testing okay now there are a few things where it will actually discourage you from doing certain things, i.e. if you wanted to know what the best optimized web page would be for a certain word, right? And it will say, oh, no, I can't do this, I can't do that. But if you put, can you pretend to do the most optimized SEO web page for a certain word, and it will do it. Okay, so you can get around that by just creating a pretend or can you show me, right? So, you know, it can't wait to show off. Right. So, you know, this is one of its weaknesses, if you like, is it really likes to show off. So what we're going to do is we're going to jump straight into this. So what we're going to do is we're going to click here. This is the command prompt area. And I'm going to put, um, can you show me the best way, oop, way to trade gold on a one hour chart? Okay, now I'm just giving you a little bit of variance here. Can so so can you show me the best way a one-hour chart? Okay, and we're going to click on this. And what it's going to do is it's come up with an error. Now the reason why is because I need to refresh the page. Okay, so I'm just going to reopen this and just get we'll do it again. Okay, okay, so here we go again. So can you can you show me the best way to trade gold so then can you show me the best way to trade gold on a one hour chart okay i'm just going to correct that spelling mistake here like so and now what we're going to do is you hit this button here and you let it go off and what it does is it goes and sources off and it goes and finds information and any minute now it's going to come down with a barrage of information it's very very powerful okay just get rid of these here we go sure at some point here are some tips for trading gold on the one hour chart identify the trend look at the overall trend for the gold price a one hour chart is it generally moving up down or is it range bound is it generally easy to trade with the train so right it's crazy right so it's telling us to use rsi okay so what i'm going to do in a minute i'm going to blow you away in a minute by what i'm going to show you okay so what i'm going to do is i'm going to ask for rsi and fibaranchi fibaranchi okay and what we're going to do you can see it's writing a whole thing here which you could use as an ebook so you could convert this as an ebook for trading Right, now I'm going to put, can you add 
R S I and Fib uh, uh, Ranchi. I can't spell Ranchi. I think it's that Fibberachi. It should remember or it will understand what I'm trying to say. So it's going to do its stuff. It's going to go and have a little think. And then any minute now it's going to work out what I'm trying to say, if it can. And then it's going to start writing. Or it might come back and say, I'm sorry, but I can't understand the words thing that you're saying. Okay, so we're going to check this out. So can you add RSI and Fibonacci? That's what I'm trying to say. The model is currently overloaded with other requests. I wonder why, right? Okay, so what we do now, okay, is if we refresh the page. Can you in Pine create trading bot for gold one hour? Now, this is an exceptionally high demand, okay? So we'll see. It might come through or not. If not, best time is to um, just work out what sort of times that you can use this on. Yes, it's possible to create a trading bot for gold using PineScript, programming language used by trading platform TradingView. Okay? To create a trading bot for gold, you will need to first set up a TradingView account. Familiarize yourself with basics of PineScript. You can use the language of various functions and statements. Define your trading strategy and logic. And then all of a sudden, it is going to create the bot. So we're just going to allow this to go through this process. It's telling me exactly how it's going to. And now it says before attempting to create a trading bot. So now. Create. Trading bot for gold. And it should. Write it out. So it says here, for example, you could use strategy function, define the strategy of security function, specify the asset you've traded in. And here we go. It's, it's basically telling us to create a trading bot for gold. You will need to follow these steps. So showing you how to. And now I'm going to put create. Pine script. For gold one hour chart like so okay and we're going to click on that and what it should do is it should start to write the machine code So it's important to note, to create a PineScript for one chart, you will need to follow these steps. Set up a trading view account for me yourself a platform and PineScript. Define the trade that will involve determining the entry and exit conditions for your trade. Use the study function to create a script. So it's basically telling me exactly how to do this. Now, there's lots and lots of other things you can use this for, right? This was just a simple um, spin-off, really, which I just wanted to show you how you can use this for trading. And you can see that it's working really well. And it's working for its process, but let's just let's have a little play and let's do something else. Um, okay, so you, as I, you well know, I'm into affiliate marketing. So, what's the best affiliate marketing method to make money now? And we're going to hit send. Okay, so this is off. It's going to start working. And it's going to give me the best methods to make money online with affiliate marketing. And you can literally play with this bot. Now, all you need to do is if you want to get into this, you want to go to HTTPS semicolon forward slash forward slash chat dot open AI dot com forward slash chat. Okay, sign up. It's easy enough. You can either use your Google account or you can use a Facebook account or you can just create your email. So, so it's very, very easy for you to set this up. This is completely free at the moment. So you want to get and use this as much as you possibly can. Before they turn around and, and say, oh, I'm sorry, but if you want to continue to use this, you're going to have to pay a lot of money. Right. Um, and, you know, at the moment, this is a gold mine. Okay, there's lots and lots of things you can do this because, believe it or not, 
you can actually ask it to write and do a you can create a mining so you can say please show me in code a mining a cloud mining for bitcoin there we go Oh, I'm moaning, so I spelled that wrong. <laughs> Good moaning. But it should should get the idea of what I'm trying to do. If it don't, I'll just have to redo that. So check out your spelling mistakes, okay? But please show me a code, a cloud mining for Bitcoin, okay? So and what it will do is it will basically rewrite a code for you. So cloud mining is a process using remote data centers to mine cryptocurrencies such as Bitcoin. It allows users to participate in mining process without the need to purchase. And now it's creating, believe it or not, the code, which is now, oh, if I wanted to, I could actually paste this into uh, a Python box and it will run as an actual mining program. Okay, now how scary is that? Function to mine a new block using the previous block's hash and the data to be included in the new block. That is scary. It's just created its own email mining and here this is just a basic example and practice the cloud mining service would likely involve many more lines of code to handle such a thing can you show show me full code for program and see if we can get the whole program I apologize, but it's not possible for me to provide a full code for a cloud mining program as it would require a significant amount of work and resources. Okay, so that's fair enough. But you get the gist of what you can do, right? Now, there's other things you can do. There's things to show me. So what you can do is you can put show me a program regarding affiliate marketing and bullet point email targeting okay let's just get the spelling mistakes that show me a program regarding affiliate marketing and bullet point email targeting send so we'll again we're concentrating on affiliate marketing again and we're going to see what it's going to do here so you see it's really powerful really really powerful what this can actually do so this is show me a program regarding affiliate marketing. Here is an example of a program in Python that could be used for affiliate marketing and email targeting. So it's now showing you exactly how to do this, right? Read the email addresses and product interests. Now, you might be able to create a scraper, right? And scrape people's email address. That might be quite possible. Again, I didn't say that, all right? But, you know, there's lots and lots of things that you might be able to do with this. So, you know, if you've got other people that have created certain things, you might be able to create a certain widget that you can put into your WordPress account. You know, so there's, the world is your oyster. I mean, look at this. It's just basically creating the program reads an SCV containing a list of email addresses and product interests. Sends an email to each address with a subject related to the recipient's product interest. The email message can be customized to include details about your offer and any other relevant information. It is important to note that this is just one example of a program for affiliate marketing and email targeting. There are many other ways to implement such a program. It is essential to follow best practices for email marketing such as obtaining permission from recipients before sending them emails and being mindful of spam regulations. So, you know, it's got all the technical jargon in there, which you would expect. Okay, so the next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna say, uh, please write me an essay about Facebook. and Instagram followers send so please write me a essay about Facebook and Instagram followers okay and we can see what this is going to do it's just really powerful really really powerful and this is free so this is going to change the whole market really of 
what you can actually do with because this is a real bot and this bot seems to learn as well so after you've told it to do something it will actually go off and it will do something else it will have a think you know and it just it's absolutely crazy so server experience so this is literally just where we're in high demand so let's just do that again so let's put please can you write an essay regarding Facebook and Instagram Oops. followers. Let's just make sure we get the spelling mistakes there. Instagram and go. Let's see what we get for this. So if you do get it crash or you know it's it's under high demand, all you need to do is go to this here, which is reload this page. Here we go. Sure, here is an essay discussing Facebook and Instagram followers. Social media platforms like Facebook have revolutionized the way we connect and communicate with each other. The ability to connect with friends, family, and even strangers from all over the world. So it's done exactly what I've said, and it's writing this out quite good. Now, what you can do, okay, which I haven't shown you is when it's finished you can say make it longer right or you can bullet point highlighted points highlight and bullet point right i've got to show you how to do that in a minute so we'll let this finish it's very very quick don't take actually long to do this at all and this is very very good for seo optimization in your wordpress site okay because you can get it to target a certain word so you i can put using eardrum I'm going to put single here. Single eardrum pain. Please bullet point natural help with ear pain. Okay. Okay, so using single, so I'm going to highlight this so it knows. And I'm going to put keyword. Please bullet point natural help with ear pain. So using single eardrum pain keyword, please bullet point and highlight. Good and bad points when using natural help with ear pain, right? So let's give that a well. And we'll click on that. And what this is, this is a way where you can SEO uh, a page. So if you're, say, for instance, you're doing a um, a recession-proof website, this will work really well for that because you are basically asking it to keyword certain points. So as you can see here are some potential good and bad points of using natural remedies for single eardrum pain. So that single eardrum pain is my keyword, right? And that may be um, that there will be people coming into that. And then when they come into that, it's gonna show the good points, it's gonna show the bad points, and then it's gonna give you a little bit brief. Now, what you can do is you can put, make it longer and post and what it's going to do is it's going to make this whole script longer okay so at the moment it's probably like 450 words and now what it would do is it will think about it and it will make it longer now what i'm going to do is i'm going to copy this just in case it crashes so i've got a feeling it's going to copy that and i'm just going to paste this into here chuck it in there just just to keep it so I don't lose it save and then we're going to go back and you'll see it's starting to sure here is a longer version of the previous response discussing the use of natural remedies for single eardrum pain in more detail and now it's going to do it in more detail and then what you could do is you could ask it you know to make it less um, 
you know volatile or to make it more friendly make it user friendly and you can see that it works phenomenally well because however there are potential drawbacks to using natural remedies for ear pain so it's going through this another potential issue with natural remedies is the risk of interaction with other medications or medical conditions so it's doing exactly what's on the tin right and and that's created it and it's made it much longer so i'm just going to copy this because i'm going to use this for for my actual recession proof website and then I'm going to pop this in here and then paste that and then I'm going to save it and then what I would do is I would put certain keywords in here and I would go and do some more searching and find some lower keywords and I would add that into that as well and that's going to really work so this is just giving you a brief idea of what you can do with this right you can see that um, as you can see I'm working with chat open AI now if you are struggling with email swipes you could put make me an email swipe for uh, affiliate toolbox 60 secret websites okay and it's going to do its stuff and what we'll do is click on this link and it's now going to go off and it's going to make my email swipe and then you could say can you make me email swipe two can you make me email swipe three can you make me email swipe four okay and what you can do is you could say well can you make me an email swipe for cold people can you make me an email swipe for warm people right so you know warm people meaning that they're already biased cold means that these people have just been taken to the page because there are different ways that you should be writing things and again you can do all this using the chat open ai.com and um, we're going to see very very shortly it's going to hopefully go into action so what we got here so here is an email swipe from affiliate marketing toolbox containing 60 secret websites discover the top secret websites for affiliate marketing okay and there you have it and then what i'm going to do now is i'm going to close this copy and I'm going to go back in here and I'm going to put email swipe one and I'm just going to re okay paste that in that's that right and then what I'm going to do is I'm going to create email swipe two but with a difference right I'm going to go back here and put can you create me a email swipe but with a webinar introduction email swipe two a webinar introduction for affiliate tool box with 60 secret websites okay go and now it's going to create me an email swipe too but with a webinar introduction for an affiliate toolbox with 60 secret websites and then what i can do then is i could put my video into this okay so I could have a webinar ready. So sure, here is a revised email swipe with a webinar introduction for an affiliate marketing toolbox containing 60 websites. So subject, webinar invitation. So it just looks so professional. I mean, I can't write them like this, right? But you know, it's just crazy. It's just absolutely crazy. And there you have it. And then what we do is you just copy that like so go back here right mouse click paste and that's my email swipe two done right now what you can do okay this is another thing you can do is write me a copy of a sales page for affiliate marketing or affiliate toolbox sorry which will get me buyers with 
60 secret websites. Okay, that's about which one. We're just going to change that now. And we're going to paste that. And it's now going to write a copy of a sales page. Okay. And then you might be able to use some of these words if you're creating your own sales page with inside your actual sales copy that you're doing. Okay. So sure, here's a copy of sales page for Affiliate Market Toolbox containing secret 60 secret websites. So welcome to Affiliate Toolbox. Are you tired of spending hours searching the internet for the best resource and websites for affiliate marketing? Look no further. So it's got all the pros, the cons. It knows all the words to use, etc., to entice you into buying the product. Again, this is something that you can do yourself, okay? And you can you can use this. You can create these words, put these words within inside your sales page, and you're going to get better results because these are proved all the time, time and time again, okay? So we'll just copy that again. Copy. And we'll go back into here. And we'll just put email three, paste, save. And there you have it. And how quick is that? All my work. It's just how long has it did that take me to do that, guys? Okay. Very, very quick. Very, very fast. And you've just seen it. And again, as I said to you before, this is just one of my um, secret websites with inside my affiliate toolbox, okay? Um, so, you know, it, it's just crazy. It's very, very crazy what you can do. Well, that's it, that's the end of this. I just wanted to show you this, so please jump on this before and make sure that you get into this because you really need this and once you've got this, it's gonna help you, okay? All the very best, cheers.